my channel Motivating Moksha. Tomorrow we are going to do Mani Dvipa Varna Puja that is on Friday. So today we are going to decorate the background for the Puja. I am going to even show the decoration process. So let's get started. For the background decoration, I ordered the Pralaya background stand from Amazon. If you want the link, it will be in the description box. Now let's unbox it. They gave us separate bag for this. And there are even some rods in this. And they gave some tripod like rods. They gave two of them. Now let's open the cover. They gave three rods. After fixing this, you have to lock them. Now, I'm gonna pull it up and show you. You have to open this and pull it as per you need it. I'm gonna pull it this much and again you have to lock it. Let's do the same to the next one. Open it, pull it as required and lock it. If you want it more bigger, you can even pull this one also. It is, it will go very big. You have to take these two rods and screw it. Now it is done. Now I'm gonna show you how to fix it. They give a knack over here, you have to remove it. You have to not lose it. They will give only one. You have to remove to the second one also. They will give you some holes over here. You have to put it over here. This is one size of this stand. If you want to increase or decrease, you can do. If you are okay with the length and width, you can lock it with the mat. Don't forget to mat it or else it will fall. It's done! If you want it more wider, you can even add this rod. Now I added one more rod to it. It is more wider than the before one. Now I increase the height also. Now let's start decorating. For the decoration, I'm gonna use these colorful clothes. These three are glitter clothes and these four are satin clothes. You have to pin to the rod like this. In a closer view, it looks like this. It should be like frills. Then you have to fold it like this and pin it. Then 
टेक अ रेड कलर क्लोथ यू हैव टू फोल्ड इट सेम लाइक द गोल्डन कलर क्लोथ बट इन द मिडल यू हैव टू लीव इट आफ्टर फोल्डिंग एंड पिनिंग दैम यू हैव टू हैंग अ ब्लू कलर क्लोथ देन आई टुक अ सेंटर टेबल एंड कवर्ड इट विथ वन मोर गोल्डन कलर क्लोथ टू गिव पीपल बैंगल्स Harshina and Kumkuma packets I thought to do something different so I did like this I'm going to show you how I did it The materials required are yellow and red color flower artificial flower and leaf like kundan golden color flower kundan and gauri bale and red color leaf type kundans Harshina and Kumkum packets some bangles you have to take four bangles and tape it together or else you can tie a thread to it and a golden color lace then you have to take green color papers now i'm going to apply some glue to the bangle and stick it to the Harshna Kumkuma packet After sticking let it dry for few minutes Now I'm going to apply some glue in some certain places where I'm going to put the kundans Now I'm sticking the gauri bale Then you have to stick a golden flower and stick two leaves. Then stick the yellow and red flowers. I'm sticking the yellow flower near the kumkum and red flower near the harshina. You have to take a green color paper. Its length is Fifteen centimeter and breadth is eleven centimeter. Now we are gonna stick this to the paper. Let's apply some glue. Now you have to stick these laces to its border. Now we are gonna fill this empty place with kundans. Totally, I did thirty-two. This is one type of design, and this is one more type of design. Now, my mom is gonna show you how to make rose with blouse piece. It is gonna be very beautiful and easy. First you have to open it completely and fold it into half and again you have to fold it into half Then you have to roll one of its end 3 to 4 times Now you have to take it you have to fold it and rotate it and again you have to fold it and rotate it fold it rotate it you have to repeat the same process till the blouse piece gets over now we have come to the end after that you have to fold it and you have to take few pins you have to pin it to the end so that it doesn't come out and if there are any parts which are loose you can even pin it there our beautiful roses done after that you have to put some glitter dots and you have to 
tie a lace to it. Then only it will look more beautiful. Now we are doing dry fruit plate decoration. First you have to add some raisins like a circle. Then you have to take few almonds and put it around the raisins. Now the almonds are arranged. Let's go to the next dry fruit. Next is cashews. You have to cut the cashews into half and you have to put it around the almonds. Now the cashews are also arranged. After putting raisins, almonds and cashews, I am putting sunflower seeds. I am putting it like a circle. After putting the sunflower seeds, you have to put the pumpkin seeds around the sunflower seeds. Then you have to cut the dried fig into half like this. Then take the half cut fig and put it in the middle of the circle. Now you have to take black raisins. You have to put the black raisins like a straight line from cashew to the fig. Now you have to put one black raisin on top of the fig. Now put few pumpkin seeds around the raisin to look nice. Now you have to put some black raisins from one fig to another one. Now our dry fruit plate decoration is ready. Now I am going to show you 32 different types of flowers. This is red hibiscus. And this is pink hibiscus. This is white hibiscus. These all flowers are different types of 32 flowers that are so bright and beautiful right my mom did 32 types of flowers 32 types of prasadams for god 32 types of blouses and 32 types of ashna and kunkuma packets and 32 deepas after so much of hard work, we completed the decoration for the puja. This is me and my father arranging for the puja. Then we completed the puja. We were not able to shoot the video because it took like 2-3 to three hours to complete the puja. These are the different types of artis which we are going to use in the puja. Now my parents are doing ekarti. Now they are doing trayarti. Now it is pancharti. My father is lighting the hadnar arti. Now they are doing the arti. This is me and my mom doing the tambit arti. These are all different types of artis. This is a picture of my mom and dad. This is a picture of me and my dad.
This is a picture of me and my mom. This is blouse piece, some sweets, some obattus, and these are some uh, kosambri, halwa, some rice items, paisam, and some laddus, and the hashna kunkuma packets, and few fruits. Pictures of people who were invited to puja. This is my dad playing with naughty Kshetrit. People who sang for Goddess Lalita Devi. Amma Laganna, Amma Muni Vu, Ni Charana Muni, Nammi Dinamma, Ni Charana Muni, Nammi Dinamma, Avayamu Sukhanu, Mantri Pani Ki Mahani Dulu, Lakshana Lakshana Lavanyamu, Lakshana Lakshana Finally, now I'm gonna show family photo. This is with my parents and my amma.
This photo is with my nanamma. This is me and my brother taking a photo. This is with my baba, I penny and my brother. This is even a photo with my dad and Kshetrit. This photo is with my Atta. This photo is with Priyanka Pinni. My mom is taking photo with my Pinnis. My mom gave Tambulam to everyone like this. This is me, my Pinni and my brother taking a selfie. I told them to give a pose but they're still talking. They're laughing and they're talking continuously. My Pinni is setting sari for the pose. Finally, they gave a pose and the picture is done. We also joined. This photo of Goddess Lakshmi is without light. This is the side view of Goddess Lakshmi. We even did puja with 108 lotus seeds, 108 gold and silver flowers, 108 cardamom and 108 red and black gauri bale. This is it for today's video. Hope you all enjoyed watching my video.